Well, today we have this device here, which we'll be able to recover in a very easy and simple way. In this video tutorial, we'll explain step by step how to recover your device. Whether it has a screen lock or a forgotten Gmail account. First of all, we always recommend watching the step by step video tutorial so you can troubleshoot this account deletion problem as well. We want to tell you that in the description of the video and in the first pinned comment we are going to leave some methods that are also totally different. There is a method without a PC. There is also a method EH by PCEH for these devices there already. Fully updated so we recommend that you watch the video. Tutorial step by step so that you cannot get ahead of it so. You can do exactly as we are going to explain in this video tutorial. First of all we are going to connect to a Wi-Fi network EH to give the device a tour so that you can see that EH our phone is totally locked and as we can see here on the left side we have what is this little lock on this device EH we also get accessibility but that does not mean that when we get accessibility our phone is not locked it is totally locked let's give it and we're going to configure our phone we're going to configure it we're going to connect to the Wi-Fi networks as we had said. We're going to hit next and now we're going to wait for our, uh, our device to show what that screen lock is, it also shows what the Gmail account is since previously we had added what a lock was. We had added a screen lock and that one and we had forgotten. So what we did was reset our phone. When we reset our phone it was left with that little padlock. We connected it to a Wi-Fi network and we are still being. Asked for the screen lock also the email. Since we previously had that email. And we had forgotten and we had not written it down. Well, we're going to wait until it takes us where the lock is on our device. I also want to tell you that we have the member session of our channel that was enabled for us on YouTube. We also want to tell you so that you can also join our community and help us grow a little more and continue bringing you what are new methods. Also I want to tell you what the benefit is, the benefit is that you are going to us. We are going to publish the video tutorials days in advance. Then they are going to be published publicly on YouTube. First we publish it in our community and then we publish it on YouTube. So you can find out about the latest updates for these devices. What we are going to do is go to home since. We can see our screen lock on our phone. We go to home. EH let's go here accessibility here as we can see we have the Talbot. Previously we entered what was drawing an L upwards and up. It gave us the option to be able EH enable what was the Google Assistant before. We enabled that Google Assistant but it is no longer working. Here double click and click here on finish double click here. Give it we say now not here we double click what is this little blue dot. And click on off it is already off we go back. And here we are going to give it several clicks here on the screen we go back and here. We will get this option to add a new network previously we also entered. Here and in some devices and we got what was gallery. It is no longer working for us either. But if we are getting this little nut that appears here. We are going to select that little nut and we go to the last option, we are going to give it this option, this one that says reset configurations. We are going to click on each one of them, the first one is the configuration. 
Here the personalized ones also and this third option as well we are going to. Click on it here we are going to delete and it says the Clier cache now what we are going to do. Well uh we are going to need what is another additional device and what. We need from this device well what we are going to need from the other. Device is that it has what is a screen lock that we. Add a screen lock to our phone we add a. Screen lock then after we add that screen lock we also need. What is a Google account? A Google account. Here I have an alternative Google account. So do that, add an account. If you don't have one well we recommend that you create a new one because all this information will be passed through there. After we have all that ready, then what we are going to do. We are going to go back, we click here on cancel, we click. Back, we click forward now here we are going. To select the first option that appears here. Ready. Here we are going to leave it, we are going to leave that option. Now what we are going to do here is go what is here to this to this code. We scan the QR code. Which was returned to us and it was synchronized. It was synchronized just click here in some parts it may. Sync just click here the code. There you will have it there ready you will write here what that. Is the block here they will sync. And everything will pass both the block and the Google account now that we have. Done that what we are going to do is press the understood button volume. Down button at the same time make our phone restart since. Everything has been synchronized. Ready now what we are going to do is restart our phone. We are going to wait for our phone to restart and then do the last process. It is fast. We are going to wait for our phone to sync and you will see how it is both. The block and we have said this the email. Everything is synchronized it will sync that email that we had on the other phone. No matter the brand no matter the brand we are going to click here now. Here we go back to where the Wi-Fi networks are we are going to delete everything. Here we deactivate everything now here click on skip. We click on skip, if you have any SIN card remove the SIN card. We click here where it says do not copy, we click here where it says skip. Skip. Here it would take us to Google services and as, you can see here we have the email that has been synchronized. Our email was synchronized correctly. Now if our email was synchronized correctly it is because this video tutorial has been successful. We click on skip, we click on add. Next and here we are in the last steps. We click next, we click here on finish. Ready, and as you can see this has been all for this video tutorial. We have recovered it in an easy and simple way. If it works for you and if you liked our video subscribe. Activate the bell, like, share, and leave a good comment.